Hey students, it's Mr. Fleece here and I'm going to show you how to use pixel art to create drawings. And now today we have a second assignment which is to draw your favorite snack but we're going to be using shading techniques. There are two types of shading techniques that are often used. One is called pillow shading and that's where the artist is outlining the very outside edge of any shape with a shade or tint. And then if you look over here on the right side, we're going to use shading and we're not going to actually cover each individual pixel. This is a more acceptable and advanced art shading technique, whereas this is more simpler and can make your drawings not look as well done. Click on the pixel art tab and it's going to bring you to the program. If this screen pops up, you're going to click new drawing, click 32 by 32 and hit OK. Close any ads that are popping up. 32 by 32 essentially means you have 32 boxes across the top and 32 boxes down the side, which are going to give you 1,024 pixels to work with to create your drawing. So I told you I'm going to create my favorite snack. So I'm going to scroll down and first start with choosing a color. One of my favorite things to snack on is carrots. So I'm going to draw some carrots. Now that I selected my orange color here, I can then start sketching my design on the screen. And I'm going to go ahead and share my carrot in with the orange. Notice how I'm just using one color right now to start. To practice shading, I'm going to come over to my color screen over here. So now I'm going to select a lighter one. And this is where I'm going to create three dimensions. One side's going to be lighter and one side's going to be darker. Then I'm going to select an even lighter color like that. Notice how I'm just tapping in the colors to give that three-dimensional effect. Maybe I'll give it a couple of bright highlights. And then I can add a few details. So I might use a brown tone to kind of draw in the carrots ridges. And then I'm going to come up here and use a green tone to draw my carrot stems. I can use a darker tone of green to shade the bottom, and it's kind of a blue-green. And now I'm going to shade my background. I think I'm going to use blues, so I'm going to choose a very light blue to first come in and shade around my carrot. I don't want my background to just be one solid shade of blue. So I'm going in and I'm darkening my background here. Notice how I'm using multiple shades and tints of a color in the background and in the foreground. Now I'm going to go even darker. I'm also creating kind of a wrap around my object here and I'm going to break up some of those really boxy areas with a few pixels by placing in those dots kind of sporadically along edges that's how I can create a gradient change of value using pixels instead of having solid shapes notice how my leaves kind of blend into the background because they're very similar I'm going to give a little bit of a highlight to the tops of my leaves but notice how I've shaded my background from this light blue to this dark blue. And I'm using pixels as pointillism to dot in those shades, kind of like doing a pointillist drawing. And also I shaded my carrot the same way. In fact, I'm gonna give my carrot just a little bit more darkness on this side. So now I've shaded this side of my carrot with a dark hue and red is a dark hue of orange so I kind of like used a scarlet color. And then on this side I used a tint where I'm using these yellow oranges to lighten this side to create a three dimensional effect on a very 2D surface. I used a little bit of white to suggest highlights and I did the same thing up here in my leaves where I used this dark blue green as my shade and I use this middle green as my main portions of the leaves and then I use this light green to show the light hitting the tops of the leaves so that my leaves of my carrot have dimension and my carrot has dimension and my background has dimension by going from a light blue to a dark blue. So this is what I'm looking for in your pixel art project 
for your favorite snack. I'm looking for you to use this shading technique. When you're finished, we're gonna come over here and click File, Download. You're gonna make sure it says Download PNG GIF right here. Then you're gonna click Size. Scroll down to 960 times 960 pixels or higher. If you can go more, then add more. We want it to be a large file so that way it's easily seen when you download it. Then click the download button. You're gonna see a little preview right here. And now it's downloaded into my Chromebook and I can come back to Canvas and I can submit my finished drawing for Digital Art Assignment 2. Click the Submit Assignment button, choose File, select your image, open. And if you wanna leave me a comment here, tell me what you made. My favorite snack is carrots. That way I know what you drew and then click Submit Assignment. Remember students, if you have questions, you can email me or you can pop into the Google Meet session and ask your questions. Thanks for watching and good luck on your drawings. I can't wait to see them.